What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess, High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Aries, and you enjoy my content, if you can ring the little bell and buy my soul tribe, I super appreciate it. Just seriously, if you enjoy my Gabby mouth or the spirit messages or the channel, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. This is Trace Hennon for Sun of Aries. This can resonate if you have Aries in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Sun, Moon, Venus, Jupiter. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. This is Trace Hennon. It's a little different than my other um, series. It's basically what they don't, don't want you to know. From anybody, a friend, a neighbor, a co-worker, a lover, a past lover, etc., etc., etc. I got two channeled in as I was meditating on your energy. Um, the first one I heard, um, an, a an Aries is about to be, um, uh, humiliated. I heard some in public and some, um, uh, privately. So, um, that was the first one and, oh crap. Let me see if I can remember the second one. Hold on a second. I can't remember the second one. I can't remember it. Sorry. If I remember it, I'll let you know. Sorry. Um, but yeah, so a cancer, I'm, I'm sorry, not a cancer. Ooh, maybe you are dealing with the cancer. Maybe somebody's dealing with the cancer. I said cancer, but I'm in Aries. Maybe somebody's dealing with the cancer. Maybe you have a cancer partner, cancer child, cancer family member, possibly. Um, but I heard that Aries is about to be humiliated, humiliated. So extremely embarrassed. Um, so I'm in a per, um, personal setting. So I think privately uh, with a personal relationship or personal, maybe something on your body humiliates you, your personal being, or in a personal relationship, you're going to be humiliated possibly. Um, and then some publicly. So in a public setting. So you plug it in, how it resonates. If I remember that second one, I'll let you know. Thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel. You guys are just the best. I just want to say it. I was on um, YouTube recommendations approximately six to nine months ago and I'm back on it. But I to be positive it's because of you guys and I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much. So I want to give a huge shout out to YouTube and a huge shout out to you guys because I think you you make it happen. I couldn't do this without you guys. So thank you guys so much. Love you guys. Just saying. Um, yeah. Six of Cups reversed, four wands upright. A fire sign is not happy about events that have occurred, but they're about to turn their pain into power in a huge way. Getting things together. About to blow it up in a positive way. Some their business, some plan on moving. Okay. Some will get offered a new job soon. Wonderful job. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Um, I heard a fire sign um, has not been happy about recent events soon. You have to plug this fire sign in your life how they fit. Aries, Leo, Sag. They could have Aries, Leo, or Sag and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or they may for Jupiter. I heard they have not been happy over re um, recent events. So something has really hurt them or made them unhappy in some shape, form, or fashion, but I heard they're not going to let it get them down. They're about to turn their pain into power. Some of them are about to move. Some are about to get offered a wonderful new job opportunity, um, and some are about to um, manifest and grow their business in a huge positive way. For some, it could be two or more. So you plug it in, how it resonates. This is uh, the fire sign not being happy about recent events. Um, you can't control the recent events or other people, but you can control yourself. So that's what I think this person is doing. They're about to turn their pain into power. They cannot control what's going on around them or events that don't control them or involve them, but they can control themselves. And that's what it sounds like is happening here. So then 
This is them not being happy about recent events. And then them, um, this is four winds upright, like um, happy, stable home life. Um, so for some, it's the moving energy because they want to move. For some, it's growing and manifesting their business. So creating a happy, stable home life for them by growing and manifesting their business. And for some other people, if they have an LLC. Um, and for some, um, what was the other one? Uh, oh, the new job energy, new job energy. So you plug it in, how it resonates, if that resonates for you. Um, I almost said Aquarius. Maybe for some you're dealing with an Aquarius as well. I almost said Aquarius. Aries, Aries. Spirit messages you have for sign of Aries. And this is what this fire sign doesn't want you to know, Aries, just let you know. Spirit messages you have for sign of Aries. A Libra is about to shock you in a huge way. Okay, so you plug it in, how that resonates. Um, this is what, I guess this Libra doesn't want you to know. I heard they're about to shock you in a huge way. So, however they're going to shock you, that could be in a positive or a negative way. Um, but some kind of shocking you energy. It can be a masculine or a femme Libra. They could have Libra in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, and Benhaven, Jupiter. But I heard they're about to shock you in a huge way. So, that could be a positive shock or a negative shock. You have to plug that shock in your life how it fits. But at least one of you guys in the universe is dealing with the Libra. If that resonates with you. Queen of Cups upright, Five of Swords reverse. An Aries friend has been unnecessarily starting drama with them recently. You have blocked them. They are very regretful and are about to make extreme efforts to apologize. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. This is a good one. This is a good one. I like it, fire sign. I'm a fire sign. That's probably what I, that's exactly what I would have done. So you go with your bad self if this resonates with you. So I heard an Aries friend. So yeah, it's a friend of yours, Aries. I heard they have caused unnecessary drama recently with you. So you block them. That's exactly what I would have done. Fire signs unite, just saying. Um, but I heard um, they're very regretful now because you did you put uh, you put their eyes on block. Yeah, I got you. Um, so they're going to find a way to come back and apologize to you. Now you put them on block, so I'm assuming on your phone. So they probably obviously you're not going to try to call you or text you or message you because they're not going to do that because you put them on block. So, for some of you guys, I feel they might try to write you a letter, like snail mail style, or they might tr um, try to, um, I'm thinking snail mail letter style, like in your mailbox, or they might try to show up at your home, possibly. Um, you plug it in, how, or your place of business, possibly, if, if you work. Um, or if you own a business, they might try to show up at the business. You plug it in how it resonates, but they're going to try to make amends with you, but they can't do it on the phone, I'm presuming, because you have put them on block. So, this is your friend energy. They're coming up as a queen of cups upright, giving loving kind towards you now, but they know they started all the beef and drama with you. Well, they should apologize, just for real, for real. Um, but they're coming back now, giving loving and kind, because they know they effed up, basically. Five swords reverse. They don't want conflict with you. You don't start none, there won't be none. Just saying, just saying. You plug it in how it resonates. This could be a femme energy coming back that has started this beef and drama with you or masculine takes on a lot of femme energy. You plug it in how it resonates if that resonates for you, Aries. Okay. Let me see if I hear anything else. We're not going to do another one.
Child support is what I just heard. Child support. Child support. Child support. So this is what somebody doesn't want you to know, Aries. Maybe they're about to have to pay child support, or maybe you're about to have to pay child support. Some, some, somebody is about to have to pay child support, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to. This is what somebody doesn't want you to know. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, and obviously um, for the Aries with the friend, I do. They don't want you to know they are very regretful that they screwed up, but you're about to find that out anyways. Because whoever this is for, you're highly intuitive. So when they try coming back around with the letter or the in person, you're going to know they're regretful. So just saying, just saying. All right, you guys, we're done. I love you guys so much. I hope everybody has a wonderful day. And if you think anyone else can benefit from the messages, please share the videos. Love you guys. Namaste.